Hi, I'm getting ready to show you how I do my Marley pony. Stay tuned. Okay, mine is a little, little bit messy because I've been wearing mine for six days now. Um, but basically, you just brush your hair, wet it. I had washed, co-washed mine and put it in the ponytail. Use Eco Styler gel or whatever kind of gel you like to slick it up. This is my first ponytail since going natural. Uh, didn't think I could get it all in a uh, ponytail holder, but I did with the help of the gel and scarf. So basically, I had already used this hair on my braids. So I, that's why I was cut in half. So basically, I take a rubber band and the hair and use the rubber band to tie the two together. Okay. Alright. Then, now it's here, I separate it. It really doesn't matter. Separate it and go one way. I'm just going to leave it together for now. Wrap this around and then pin. My hair is coming down in the back. It's still wet. This may not be the best Molly Braid ponytail that you, you're going to run across on YouTube, but it is the way I do it. And this is my first time doing it, so I'm sure with this Molly hair, it's so awesome. And it blends so well with our natural hair that I know I'm going to be using this hair for many more styles and many more ponytails. So we basically just pin it all around. Back, like I said, keep coming down. All you do is, if that happens, add more gel and tie the scarf around, as you know. All right, so that's like the foundation. Then you take the hair. Um, you know how they have the beige, orange color rubber band? I took that off because you can see it, and I replaced it with a black rubber band. And you just put that here and put one side in one direction. You know, you can kind of diagonal it, if you can see. Um, and then just wrap it around the ponytail. And then pin. I think open bobby pins work better, but I'm using a lot of closed ones because I have mostly closed bobby pins. Okay. Of course you would pin in more than that. But I'm just first take the time just showing you how it goes. And then take the other side and do the same thing, wrap it around. I've seen some people twist their hair. I just kind of left it like it is. You can pull it tight to make it tighter or smaller or leave it loose to make it bigger. And that's pretty much it. Like I said, it works so well with our natural hair. Um, this waviness came from, of course, just my hair being wet in the gel um, and the scarf. So the waviness of my hair plus the waviness of this Marley hair um, just blends so well together. My hair keeps falling down in the back, but hey, here you go. <laughs> I've been for the last six days been jelly, 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 and scarfing, scarfing, scarfing. So you can add a flower to accessorize. Let me grab mine. So you can kind of put it on the side. And um, let's see. Make that go a little bit. Or you can put it in the back. I'm not going to pin it, but you see how it is. And that is my Molly Pony. Hope you enjoy it. Hope you try. Leave a uh, comment. Uh, let me know how you like it. Uh, you do the style if you try the style. Send me a video and subscribe. Have a blessed day. God loves you.